justice the word comes from the latin jus meaning right or law justice is a concept on ethics and law that means that people behave in a way that is fair equal and balanced for everyone justice is one of the most important moral and political concepts life may not always be fair to you but you can always be fair in life observe good faith and justice toward all nations cultivate peace and harmony with all justice is the legal system that a country used in order to deal with people who break the law injustice anywhere is a threat to justice everywhere justice consists not in being neutral between right and wrong but in finding out the right and upholding it where you were found against the wrong if you want peace work for justice justice means giving each person what he or she deserves truth never damage a cause that is just without justice the world might just fall apart right is right even if everyone is against it and wrong is wrong even if everyone is for it justice is not just something that is out there it is something that you can practice every day first respect all people even if they are different from you second help others if they are being treated unfairly third think what is best for everyone instead of just what is best for you justice means fairness that is giving to persons what is due to them justice helps us figure out what is fair what is right and what is wrong rules and laws help people figure out what is just or fair ask yourself have you even treated anyone unfairly how did you feel guilty how do you feel if you have not been treated with justice how you feel sad why do you think justice is so important in the world we'll see that why is justice important it makes sure that people are treated fairly it gives everyone the same chance to succeed it makes the world a better place for all of us aristotle says justice consists in what is lawful and fair with fairness involving equitable distributions and the correction of what is inequitable justice is of central importance to political theory persons involved in every agitation for securing their interest always raise the slogan we want justice all civil rights movements are essentially movements for justice justice is the most important and most discussed objective of the state and society justice is the basis of orderly human living what are ways we can show justice and fairness at our school first to treat all people equally the same second cooperate with one another third be respectful and listen to what others have to say fourth be willing to do what is the best for everyone fifth play by the rules at all times be a good sport sixth include others in games and activities don't leave people out seventh understand that being fair doesn't always mean the same treatment in every circumstance for example your younger sister may not have as many household chores as you eight stand up for someone you see being treated unfairly you can make a difference justice demands the regulation of selfish actions of people for securing a fair distribution equal treatment of equals and proportionate and just rewards for all justice stands 
for harmony between individual interests of society we can stand up and speak out for what is right and for fairness in our communities we can tackle issues such as bullying and prejudice such as race social class we can be global citizens of change inspirational people who fought for justice on behalf of others from mahatma gandhi to baba saheb ambedkar to megha patkar india has witnessed many inspirational personalities who have fought for injustice on behalf of others